have you play a little <laughs> round of wild ones here. Uh oh. These are really wild foods, and by wild, I mean they would disgust most people. Um, and I will ask you a question for each one as you go down the line, shall okay, we? Okay, 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 here All we right. go. It's payback time. It's payback time. Now, there's even a bonus round if you make it through these. Okay, okay. Would you like to begin on this end with fermented shrimp? Or perhaps on this end, with head cheese. It's a real uh, Sophie's choice here. I think I'll start with <laughs> fermented shrimp, though. <laughs> All right, uh, please, do partake. OK. You know, I ate the wings with you, Rachel. I, I, I take did it you on ever a get solo. Sick? Did you ever get sick on a wing? So uh, I feel like maybe the responsibility of the interview turns it into an out-of-body experience. But one time, I had a big <laughs> lunch. And then I ate the wings with like all the hot sauce with like the milk chaser, and I was like, whoa, like, whoa. they're gonna have to wheel me out of here. Uh -huh. Bottoms up. Oh. You did you it for are me. Hardcore! Hard What's up? Hard. What's up? Very salty. Which, which celeb has done the worst on hot ones? You already know, because you had him on the show and you checked him on it. It was oh, DJ oh, Khaled. DJ, yes, Khaled! <laughs> DJ Khaled sucked at that game. Got the That's three right. wings, That's and then right. you had him on the show That's and right. you gifted him a That's basket of hot, hot sauce. sauces. That's <laughs> so right. Uh, okay. Do I have to move on to the Yeah, you have to now? move on to silkworm. And this really, it really looks like silkworm, you know? Because they really are. <laughs> okay. Oh, man. Oh, okay. You are awesome! Now I know what it's like to be trapped on my show. You know, sometimes <laughs> I lose that perspective. Okay. You eat wings. What about chicken How feet? How about some feet? <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> How do I do it? <laughs> just just, just kind of gnaw on it. Mmm, mmm. Get some of that toe joint. <laughs> a little cartilage. You want a little, <laughs> a a little, little sauce? Taste <laughs> yeah, it'd be like a beach vacation. Oh my God. Okay, when did you realize? <laughs> when did you realize that eating things was a talent and that you were spectacularly good at it? <laughs> You know, I think, you know, there's never a time that I was like, whoa, I can eat spicy food. Like, I need to share this with the world. You know, it was just sort of a disruptive element in our interview show. But then when people started paying attention, it was like, whoa, this is crazy. So I think, like, the spice life chose me, not the other way around. Not the other way around. Yeah. Are you a fan of head cheese? You know, I guess we'll find out. The, the most interesting thing about head cheese is the sound it makes when you put it on a deli slicer. It literally sounds like... You know, it's a, a lot of wild ones is psychological, Rachel, and you're... you're so... <laughs> Could you ever date a woman that was not into spicy food? You know what? I would prefer it. You know, really? I think that you need a yin-yang thing in a relationship, really? and since my whole life is spicy food, what I need in a partner, what I need in a woman is someone who's like, hey, let's go get ice cream. Like, hey, let's go get <laughs> spaghetti carbonara. Let's make it ourselves, and we don't have to put any hot sauce in it. You know, I want to escape that world. Take me out of it. Make, make me carbonara. whole. Now you can make carbonara, I can make it right? for her. I can make it we for her. We did really well. We're, we're good too. <laughs>